isn't just a sport like football or cheerleading. Rugby is an all-inclusive sport. It doesn't matter your size, your age, your experience, your natural fitness or your talent. The girls aren't bitchy. They won't slag you off behind your back and they're always there for each other. And that's the best thing about this team is that there's none of it that comes with other teams, especially full of girls. This team, doesn't matter who you are, where you come from, what you are or what you identify as, this team will include you. Is included and everyone can play and everyone can have different roles. So like I'm on the wing and you get to see like all the action and you can always have people in different places for support so everyone knows who they've got for their support and everyone is all like in together in the game. primary school. Um, it wasn't exactly the best rugby because at that time girls would they play tag rugby or something like that and the lads would get the experience throughout secondary school as well to play rugby. So when I joined secondary school we tried but the team didn't flourish, there's not enough interest in women's rugby. Now being at university and being actually able to play for a proper women's team um, I think it's absolutely fantastic because it, it means that women get the actual chance to play rugby that they didn't have through secondary school and it's going to raise a bit more awareness and hopefully uh, women will get the chance to play rugby like the lads do throughout the whole of their school time. <laughs> Women's rugby is such a good sport to play and you have so much support from like all your teammates and we have such good socials as well. Like we've just got our new committee so everyone's like raring to go for our second year at the University of Derby. founded upon the grassroots level, which is complete amateur, down your local park, on a Sunday or a Saturday, training with your mates. But especially in women's rugby, you can go from grassroots, which is what the University of Derby team is, or the local women's rugby team for Derby, and you can progress through to the Litchfield side, which has a championship side and a premiership side, which there's a lot of interlinking with the players, the socials, and coaches and there have been three girls that have played for the Six Nations just gone that for England that play for Litchfield which is fantastic so girls coming into rugby start off at the lower levels and within three or four seasons can get up there playing Premiership rugby without any kind of 
sponsorship deals or financial effort or extra time going into it. I think it's really come into its own. Uh, like we've just got a winning sevens that's been put into the 2018 Commonwealth Games. So can't wait to see that. And women's rugby on all fronts in the union is doing really well. And I can't wait to see it progress more and see more like local players that I know go up into the big leagues and play for rugby in England. I think it's now getting more recognition, especially with winning the World Cup. Um, and the fact that we've actually managed to set up a team from nothing to what it is now. Um, like I said earlier, women don't generally get the chance to play rugby lower down at lower ages. It's only when you get to about this age that there are clubs that you can play for. And that can put some women off because they're like, I don't want to play, I don't know how to play and stuff like that. So I think it, with it progressing as it is, we're definitely getting somewhere. I've just um, come down tonight to train with the University of Derby women's rugby team. Um, so far we've done a bit of touch, we've done a few line outs. Uh, we're working on our handling as we've got a game next week against Nottingham Trent Uni who we beat last time 74-10 uh, and we're aiming to improve on our skills and our overall fitness in preparation for our game against Nottingham Trent. We're away this week the next game um, and we want to try and outdo our previous personal best score um, by training tonight as a team um, so Derby Uni can finish this season off in style. Derby Uni have just come back yesterday night from Isle of Tor. We went to Salufis 15 and we played beach rugby against many other teams including Exeter, Warwick, Coventry. We played four games and beat, um, beat two other teams in extraordinary wins. Playing beach rugby was the most amazing thing I've ever done. We bonded as a team, we came up with new chants, new things for our next year's freshers to do, new challenges and overall we've bonded as a team and improved our skills dramatically by playing on the beach. The team environment it's unlike any other sport because it's so physically demanding that everyone needs to make sure that we can rely on everyone else and it makes for a really solid team atmosphere. We're there for each other, on the pitch, off the pitch and it's got a really good vibe. There are many things I would say to a fresher wanting to start rugby. The number one being hashtag rugby before all else. Rugby is the best thing that has ever happened to me, especially at Derby Uni. You make friends, you don't just make friends for uni though, you make friends for life. And it's rather than just a friendship group, it's a family circle. You're there for each other through thick and thin, and you're there to help each other and support each other, not just on the field, but at training, in socials, even with academic work, everyone's there to help each other. Um, I'd say just come down, give it a try, yeah, you probably will get muddy, you probably will get wet and you probably will get cold, but it will be the best thing you've ever done and it will change your life forever. Definitely come and give it a go and you'll have so much fun. 